lines of incisions are marked. A low subcoronal incision is made in order to preserve inner preplacial layer for later labia minora reconstruction. Follow spinal deglaving. Scrotum is divided in the middle, continuing with five perineal incision. Testicles are mobilized and funiculus ligated at the level of external inguinal meatus. Central tendon is incised and wide perineal space for the placement of neovagina created between urethra, prostate and bladder anteriorly and rectum posteriorly. Prostate is clearly visible. After appropriate dissection, 2-0 white suture is passed through the sacrospinous ligament using the sharp needle folder and pulled out for later near vaginal fixation. Bulbospongiosal muscle is incised in the middle, mobilized and excised. Urethra is fully mobilized using mostly sharp dissection. Neurovascular bundle is dissected using combined sharp and blunt dissection. Cavernosal arteries are identified at the level of crura and ligated. Crura are partially dissected from pubic bones and divided. Remaining cavernosal tissue is destroyed with cautery and crural remnants are closed. Tips of corpora are left with the glands for better neoclitoral fixation. Ureter is divided 4 to 5 cm distally from atus and opened ventrally. Glandular urethra is deepitalized and glands is closed ventrally. Glands reduction is done medially in order to preserve vascularity and sensitivity of both neoclitoris and future labia minora. Corporal tips with neoclitoris are fixed to the corporal remnants. Remaining subglandular urethral part is used for creation of epithelial lining between neoclitoris and new urethral meatus. Penile skin is opened dorsally and urethra transposed ventrally through the formed hole.
The urethra is open dorsally, creating long urethral flap, which is joined with penile skin flap. This way, composite vagina is formed, inverted, placed into previously created perineal cavity and fixed to the sacrospinous ligament in order to prevent its prolapse. Labia minora are fixed to the penile skin. Scrotal skin is excised and labia majora created for scrotal subcutaneous tissue and penile skin. Preservative filled with sponge is placed into new vagina. Six months later, aesthetic appearance of new vagina is satisfactory. Depth and width of new vagina are excellent, like in normal females.